Uh, my name is Roger Hicks, but um, one day I met a guy named Paul Beer, and he's a pixel artist. He works. Uh, he worked on a lot of popular games, and he decided to take a chance on me, and we made this game called Celestial Mechanical. I just had all these ideas, and I was like, I don't want. You know, Paul Beer was like, well, it should have like 8-bit sounds, and it should have all this stuff. I was like, I don't want to do that. I just want to make whatever I wanted to make when I wanted to make when I wanted to make it. So the whole soundtrack has like no 8-bit stuff in it whatsoever. It's just like whatever I thought fit. And I think that's what made this game stand out. Because otherwise, I mean, I think it's fun. And I suppose other people think it's fun too. But I think <coughs> the, the contrast between the, you know, it kind of had like a, like a rock opera-ish type sound to it. I think... Josh from Playism hit me up, and um, they were like, "Hey, we want to, you know, help you actually translate it for Japan." And I was like, "Wow! Like, why is all this crazy? You know, all these people are talking to me that I just feel like I shouldn't have any of these opportunities." So I think when I met Josh, that's when I started to realize that I really wanted to like continue with this. A lot of people were actually way more interested in the soundtrack and they were like asking me like how did I make all the sounds and stuff like that and since you know I became a programmer developing all those prototypes and stuff like that I decided to make my own tracker and just tell people hey use my tracker or whatever <laughs> so that's when I made uh, Pulse Boy and Pulse Boy is actually a you probably won't be able to see the entire thing, but it's actually a uh, a uh, Game Boy synthesizer. And I was trying to figure out the simplest way to explain it, <laughs> but it, it actually goes way past the limitations of a Game Boy. But it allows you to make sounds that sound exactly like a Game Boy and also put your own samples in. I made this because I felt like I wanted to help people do do stuff that they wanted to do and instead of just making something where you know like as my parents would say nobody's gonna really gain anything from this but I felt like people were actually gonna gain something from this because they can actually create stuff with it but now I'm like yeah, I'm not really happy with that <laughs> either I want to do I want like the best of, the, of both worlds so that's when I was gonna show the, the last screenshot which is a new project that I'm working on called Band Saga, which is like the best of both worlds. It's like a game and it has a story and it's, you can create music in it and you can, you can program it and you can make your own story and you can do all this other stuff. And I'll have to show it to you on Sunday. Because <laughs> I gotta go. But thanks for listening to my whole rant. Hope everybody, or somebody was encouraged by it. So.